Yes, massive. Welcome back to Reggae Dance Hall Vault. And today I want to talk about an interview Ninja Man did with Emily Crooks. Well, not just the interview itself, but I want to go to a backstory upon how this interview resurfaced and went viral. Yeah, man, so for who don't know what we are talking about is Ninja Man did an interview in early 2003 with Emily Crooks, a journalist working at TVJ. She had a program called Exposure. Now, this interview was mainly pertaining to Ninja Man's performance at Sting 2002, where Ninja Man brought an unlicensed firearm and gave it to Renita Adams, a police officer at the time. A member said, not like this never happened before in the history of Jamaica, you know, where artists just bring him gun on stage and get to police. So it was a big thing. Whole heap of people are talking about it as a boy, as a ninja man had. The guy can bring him gun on stage and them thing there. So that was what the interview was about. But I know that more want to talk about. More want to talk about how the video get for go viral after it was resurfaced. Well, here I go on. Make me go into the back story. Alright, me have a bridging name, one five. When me have pressure for about seven, eight years straight. Cause him say him have a video cassette with Ninja Man when him day in at the church. And through me have the audio to it for how long years about me have the audio. And I want to find the video and can't find it. So me have pressure this brother here cause him say him have it and one year pass. Me have say send the thing come no since you have it. He must say him can't find it. Till one day he must say, you know, I said probably they in my garage and one of them box they in the garage. Me I said, Bridging, they not going to the garage, man. Three year pass. Four, five year pass. Me I pressure this brother here and can't get it. Till finally, round 2020. He must say, you know, I said, I find the cassette. Some said, me I said, which cassette? He must say, the ninja man, man, when him there in the church. Me I said, send it come right now. See? So, him goes and him send it come give me and... I dig up my old VCR with me have and, you know, clean it up and put it night and line it up on my laptop and everything good and Chris and my cousin, I watch it still and I say, but I know I can't see Ninja Man in my church. The same one with Bunty Kilite go there to and I need to see it and I can't see it. All I say, I want to interview and I say, I joke thing this star. So I call him back and I say, yo, one of the video this brethren. It's a one video where Ninja Man had one interview and I know that more as a star, more as a Ninja Man in the church. Can you say you have it? Come like a liar, tell him I say, no nah, man, I'm going to look for it. So I say, you know what, I'm going to just upload this and put it up and I tell you massive, from the minute I go and put it up on Facebook and YouTube, the thing just a can't away. So everybody me see with it, people are cut clippings. People put up the whole light, people put up apartheid, but the things start go viral. One of my brethren, him have a YouTube channel too, and him take it and put it up. And the thing just a can't tell everybody I watch it. And so till probably a week after, I'm looking at my inbox, I get something from TVJ. I said, big man, you need to take down that, you know. <laughs> I said, John was star. So I go, son, I take it down off of YouTube. And I make it a run on Facebook and I say, you know what? I take it down off a two platform them, you know. So I take it down. My brethren now, where him take it and put it on film channel, I tell him, say, you probably need to take it down, you know, because TVJ reach out to me and say, boy, if you take it down. And he must say, are you them tell me? Me wait till them tell me. But two days pass and him say, you know, so them send it to me too. But I not take it down, yeah, man. The people them love it. <laughs> Yo. Hey, you see by another two d and him not take it down. Him call me, me hear him voice, me I say something wrong, you know. He must say, you know, so me get a strike, star. TVJ, me, me get a strike from YouTube, I So me I said to him, said, then me not tell yourself to you take down the something, brethren, and you yeah, play brave and I know your own. <laughs> yes, so me I say. But anyway, yeah, man, I saw that interview, they get for dig up back and resurface and, you know, end up go viral and thing. A massive more on a cuss out one five two, you know. Carl, no, me can't see that video the way I'm supposedly have with Ninja Man Day Night Church, you know. Well, I'm glad me have the audio to it. 
and me need for repost it back on the Panda channel yeah. So look out for that one there. But yeah man Mas, if you don't know the thing already you know we are go back in the vault and as we always say, love and love alone.